हेलो व्यूवर्स इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन इम्पॉर्टेंट लिमिट एंड दिस लिमिट इन्वॉल्व द ग्रेटेस्ट इंटीजर फंक्शन राइट सो लेट एस स्टार्ट नाउ हियर वी हैव टू इवेल्युएट लिमिट एक्सटेंस टू जीरो माइनस एंड इट दिस नोटेशन इम्प्लाइज दैट वी हैव टू फाइंड द लेफ्ट हैंड लिमिट ऑफ दिस फंक्शन right so the function is pi plus square root of sin 1 plus greatest integer x divided by uh, greatest integer x plus 2 right and here uh, the condition is the greatest integer x is not equal to minus 2 right so let us uh, uh, evaluate this limit and here uh, see uh, x tends to uh, 0 minus right now what does this uh, uh, notation uh, implies it implies that uh, we have to approach uh, zero uh, from the left of uh, x is equal to zero right uh, moreover uh, when x tends to uh, zero minus then we are uh, uh, very close to x is equal to zero right so when x tends to 0 from the left of 0 then we are very close to x is equal to 0 right so now from uh, this uh, number line uh, we see that uh, uh, minus 1 it lies somewhere here right and uh, when x tends to 0 from left then we are very close to 0 and let us take this point as a right now this point a uh, can be taken as 0 minus h right and uh, this h is a very very small quantity right but uh, it is greater than 0 right so now we see that uh, from this uh, number line that uh, a lies between a lies between Uh, minus one and zero, right? So when x tends to zero from left, then we see that uh, the value of x it lies uh, between minus one and zero, right? Okay. So now uh, from this inequality, uh, we see that uh, the value of greatest integer x. is always equal to minus 1 whenever x lies between minus 1 and 0 now from the definition of greatest integer function we know that uh, uh, if uh, x is say uh, minus 0.5 right and minus 0.5 uh, lies between minus 1 and 0 therefore the value of greatest integer Minus zero point five is equal to minus one, right? So that's why uh, from this inequality, that is when x lies between minus one and zero, then the value of uh, greatest integer x is equal to uh, minus one, right? So here, uh, when x approaches to zero from the left of zero, then we are uh, we are placed between minus 1 and 0 so the value of greatest integer x is equal to minus 1 and we are going to uh, use this value in this function right so now uh, let us denote this limit by l and uh, l can be written as the limit uh, x tends to uh, 0 minus and we have pi plus square root of sin and we have 1 minus 1 right because the value of greatest integer x is equal to minus 1 when x lies between minus 1 and 0 right and in the denominator uh, we can write minus 1 plus 2 and now we can simplify it so limit x tends to 0 minus here we have pi plus square root of sin of 0 and here 2 minus 1 is 1 
right and we know that the value of sin 0 is equal to 0 right so this limit uh, can be written as uh, pi plus square root of 0 divided by 1 and we can write it limit x tends to 0 minus and this is uh, pi and uh, this limit is now equal to pi right so uh, viewers the value of uh, this limit when x tends to 0 from the left of 0 is equal to pi